Hi, I'm Felicia Romain from First Take NYC. Today, the NYABJ crew interviewed people throughout New York City about Barack Obama's election victory. This past Tuesday, Obama became the first African-American president-elect of the United States. The Chicago senator won over 300 electoral votes. A candidate needs 270 electoral votes to win election. Obviously, this was a big win. People are related about the upcoming president. While McCain's supporters are not too ecstatic about the results, they still feel that Obama is strong enough to do the job. Here are some of what people have to say. Oh, I'm related. I'm elated, and you never saw such long lines at the polls. It's like, I think it's really great because a lot of young people got involved, whereas the other elections, you know, it wasn't really that much involvement with young people, even though, you know, they had to lock the vote and all that stuff. So I am elated. I am so excited. I was wanting this since, like, way before he even got the nomination and all this stuff. Like, my friend is really, 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 like, into Barack Obama. She worked for his campaign, and she, like, got me into him and stuff, and I was so excited. Uh, I'm not going to say everything. Everybody say, oh, my kid could be president, but mm -hmm. it is the truth, and he make a lot of opportunity for a lot of us, you know, more open-minded and make you feel like you want to do something extraordinary. <laughs> okay, and I think it's a great moment in history and for the African-American. I don't believe anybody that calls themselves black is really black because the color of my shoe is black. I don't know by anybody that color. Mm -hmm. So I say African-American. I don't say Hispanic because I don't hear Hispanic. I'm Latina. Mm -hmm. But I didn't vote for Barack Obama. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. um, but you know what? Now that he's president, um, I feel that a chance has to be given. Mm -hmm. um, perhaps he may take us in the right way but you're always gonna have people questioning because that's democracy. Mm -hmm. So right now, from what I heard in today's radio, I'm, I'm happy with, with, the, with the fact he's our president. I've, I've come to it. It took two days crying, mm -hmm. but I'm happy now. Um, me personally, actually, I feel like um, it's like the greatest thing that could happen right now for all people because why, whether um, any true political change actually happens or if it doesn't, just off the strength there's a black man in office, it's a little Chinese kid in Chicago that wants to be an astronaut, that's gonna be an astronaut because a black man is a president. It's a little Mexican kid in California and wanna be on TV and he's gonna be on TV because a black man is president. <laughs> I think it's amazing. My uh, my mom is black mm -hmm. and um, an immigrant from Haiti and I know that mm -hmm. when she found out that Barack was gonna be president, she was really proud and it's a huge accomplishment.